But what is STEM education? The acronym STEM stands for Science, Technology, Engineering, and Mathematics. It is a process of teaching that integrates these four disciplines to promote real-world experience, teamwork, and the authentic application of technology. Additionally, it also promotes discovery, problem-based learning, and project-based learning. STEM is supported by the National Science Foundation and the U.S. Department of Education. On this website right here, Square One is a Michigan-based nonprofit that supports STEM education. I thought I'd just show you a couple pictures of what STEM education uh, can look like. There's a lot of variety of forms that it can take, but maybe if we can get a couple uh, snapshots of what it looks like in the classroom, it'll help us to have a better picture of uh, STEM education. Uh, Square One promotes, as you can see right here, Square One uh, promotes STEM education. They give grants. Uh, their website is www.squareonenetwork.org. They sponsor the Tivitz Tournament, which is an integrated um, math and um, mainly math and math and science uh, tournament. They do innovative vehicle design, remotely operated vehicle challenge. They have a lot of different programs that they, that they sponsor, not only for high school, as you see in this picture, but also for elementary as well. In fact, let me click over to um, the Tivitz. We'll take a look at what, the, what Tivitz looks like. Um, in fact, let me just go ahead and start this video. This is the Tivitz tournament that was done at the Detroit Zoo. It is a math tournament. Tivit is a competition promoting engineering, science, and math. We eyed our competition closely. We set up for the first month of competition. Like this prairie dog, we diligently prepared. The competition was fierce, but like a true wolverine, we stood our ground. Another way that uh, we might see uh, STEM education portrayed is Robotics Academy. So at Wayne Risa we have a Robotics Academy. Now I'm going to go ahead and click on that right here. Uh, it's our summer camp, so Robotics Summer Camp. And in this uh, Robotics Academy, they are using uh, Fisher Techniques kits, which is a lot of times used in, by undergrads in mechanical engineering schools. But we do it with elementary and, and middle school students. I'll just go ahead and click on this so you can kind of see what it, what it might look like in the classroom. The Robotics Academy is a summer camp for 4th grade through 7th grade students. We learned about science through technology projects using engineering and math. We built a simulated assembly line robotic welder. We also built a two-story elevator that was remote controlled. We used the computer to program everything we designed. If we had any difficulties, Mr. Johnson was there to help. We had many engineering competitions and group activities. We had to design a bridge that could be manufactured inexpensively but the bridge must not fail. We built tools to survive on a deserted island. We also had a bridge competition. We designed and built bridges out of marshmallows and toothpicks. If the bridge collapsed, you were out. We built a windmill that had to pick up weights. However, we didn't use natural wind. Our wind came from our lungs. Our last competition was the egg drop. We had to design and build packaging that would keep an egg from breaking when dropped from 10 feet. Some people design parachutes. If your egg survived, you were a winner. But sometimes we had to refine our design. There were many awards and we all had fun. So these student projects um, actually can be found if you go to our w website here at Wayne Risa. If you just type in www.risa.net, and if you'd like to see these videos um, again, just go down to Student Services, click on Student Services. 
and you can see some of the different projects. Has the Tibbetts video, uh, has the um, education summer camps, we have robotic summer camps, renewable energy summer camps, and of course the engineering summer camp, the video that you saw. Lastly, I'd like to show you Project Lead the Way. Project Lead the Way is designed to really integrate the engineering, mathematics, science, and technology. It's an excellent program. We've in the past um, sponsored many educators in Wayne County to attend the training that's been, that's been held. It's a three-week training at Eastern Michigan University.